name's Terry Reed, and uh, I'm here on behalf of Paletti Guitars in Italy, Filippo and Mr. Paletti. Uh, we met up on an idea. They developed different guitars um, custom-wise for different people. Now, the way this started, I was talking to Filippo, and uh, he called me and said, we'll make you a guitar. In your wildest dreams, what would you like? Well, you, you're asking a guitar player that, you never know where it lends. But there's always been a thing that I've been wanting to get somebody to, to build just this guitar. And I'll be honest with you, they built exactly what I wanted, piece by piece. Uh, now we took a lot of patience, they had a lot of patience with the thing and they really got what I meant. So I'll explain simply what this guitar is. Is where we grew up, we always wanted a Fender, we always wanted a Gibson, we always wanted a Gretsch, Oh, and it goes on and on. I've got a, a Gretsch Filtertron under the bridge. Because Gretsch to me always had that high, always had that high end, that glistening sound that you that you want somewhere in there. Right? Now Gibson's would always give me the punch and and some overdrive or you know, just power. Because when they made those humbucking pickups, the amps were this big. Right? Oh, that's the they were about this big. <laughs> not, not 18 inches, no, they were that big. <laughs> so the thing is they made the pickup so powerful. So this is a double coil humbucket, okay? And this one's a P90, which we all love. My, that's my favorite pickup actually, which is a big way on pickup, right? So this is how I make it work. So I've got one volume control for the P90 which I love, and I've got one volume control, right, for the humbucking double coil, which I'll get to in a minute. And I've got one volume control for the Filtertron Gretsch, right? Okay, then on the end here, I have the last one tone control for all of whatever combinations that I'm gonna show you in a minute, that, that right there, right? So this whole thing, works in different patterns. You don't want to go back to change the tone of the guitar, I don't anyway, to go back to your amps to change things. You've got time for that, especially I sing at the same time, so that's a nightmare, <laughs> it a start. So if you want to just change the, in, in full flight, you want to change the tone of the guitar, I'll show you how you go about it. Okay. <laughs> 